smile on your face. Oh, yeah. Four one against a side you'd said to me were uh, well title contenders. Well, they've, they've won the last two games. You know, I don't know about title contenders, but I, I think they'll still be there at the end of the season. And that was probably one of our best performances of the season in patches. Yes, I'm not saying that, that we're there. But by no means we're there. The goal we gave away again tonight was soft. You were unhappy. Yeah, the guy, you? the guy's beating four of us, and then and then we switched off and. No, not how we met. Tom, no, but the estimate, well, again, I used the word on on, um, on Saturday, tantalising. Well, it was again tonight. I thought Pullman was absolutely fantastic tonight. It was brilliant, wasn't it? I thought Ian Pullman was getting, on well, the goal, his second goal especially. He'll tell you the first goal he meant to dip it over the wall and the free kick. That was a good goal. But the one from outside the box, well, I mean, there's not many people in this, in this division can do that. Pullman's one of them. There's we're, not many people ready. in many divisions that can uh, do that. It's awareness, he knew where the goal was. We're very fortunate to have him. We are, yeah. we are. But you know, there was a lot of good performances tonight. Yeah. But Mike Gale, Gale there, done, done so well, you know. That's again, he's, he, he's had to take get his place. And, uh, of course the forwards, you know, Kane and, Kane and Tom. The defence is late, it's disappointing we let a goal in, and they're all disappointed. Because the defence played great. They did play well. Played great, but we let a stupid goal in, you know. Yeah, it's, it's very frustrating when you, your keeper's a spectator for most of the game yeah. against a very good side. Yeah. It means your defence is doing well. Yeah. But, as you say, it was a sloppy goal, wasn't it? Yeah, I mean, that, that was a good, he was a good player there, left back, though, wasn't he? Yeah. Sorry, the left outside player, the yeah. 11. Yeah. Very, very good, very good. But, what quality goals we scored? Ah, they're all good goals. We played, it's not that, somebody's been going to get that now for a few weeks. We've created loads, like, for instance, um, Scott Hare had six great chances on Saturday and, and never got a goal. Uh, again, he's had two or three tonight. And tonight it was, it was a ton of Tom Loins to have the chances. And then when he did score, I thought, oh. Very, very happy chairman. Catching me with a smile on me. Yeah, I know, I know. It's lovely, isn't it? Three weeks running. Yeah. Absolutely. I, I thought you were proposing to one of the supporters at half time because you were so happy. But no, it's. Uh, win treble, look. Yeah, get in there, Danny, as well. Go on. Go on, Dan. No. I go between two songs. <laughs> <laughs> um, Gary, you must be delighted. Absolutely delighted. I thought yeah. the boys played really well, and I thought Jim and Danny put together a tremendous team and um, shown what Whistable should be about. And the passion and pride we're now playing with is superb. It's a credit to Jim and Danny. It's fantastic, isn't it? And a good pitch to play on tonight. Yeah, it is a good pitch. And, and Kosh Olsen said that they had difficulties getting here this evening, but um, they said it was uh, a great surface to, w to play on, but they, they perhaps felt that some of their players are still on the coach. But um, I thought the Clash on people were, were very, very good, and um, they in fact picked our man of the match tonight, and they chose uh, Tom Loins. I think if you ask a lot of people around the ground, there's was, there was many men of the match for us, and uh, the players stood up well and showed some real desire, passion, and commitment. And that's what we want, and but that comes from Jim and Danny's lead, it really does. Well, yeah. nicely that um, young, young Matty can step in as well. Well, let me tell you, tonight the bench was, I think there was three under 21s on the bench. Mike Healy played, Tom Lines is on their kid, uh, young players all over the place. Nobody's older than uh, Pullman, it's Pullman's... 30. Tomorrow, it's his 30th birthday tomorrow, yeah, you indeed. know. So, and he's our oldest player, by a streak. By a streak. So, nah, we, we came here, me and Danny, we came here with we, we a vision to, to give it a couple of years and get us into the playoffs and have a go. We're a dad ahead of ourselves at the moment, and we're still not happy the, the way everything is. Don't I mean on, on the playing side. So, yeah, just keeps us really happy. I know the people that are coming to play and watch and enjoying what they're seeing. So let's hope we can keep doing that for them. Absolutely. Thanks very much. And uh, onwards and upwards on Saturday, three bridges away, I believe. There we go. Yeah. There we go. It's, we, we can be better on the road. That's for sure. We, mm. we, we haven't sort of like. That's now six games here, I think, one five and draw one. Mm. That ain't bad. No. Anybody's book. That's fantastic. I think, I think we should note those. We've, we've had some excellent travelling support uh, this, this year. And uh, as always, and mm. I think we're getting more and more people go to our away games. So, you know, it, it's a fantastic spread of people are getting to, to travel. And um, they've been an absolute credit. And, uh, you know, we'd only like a few more people to come and watch us here at the Belmont and take advantage. And, and you know, we've got two or three games coming up. And October the 4th is our next home game. Uh, Walton Casuals, so it's a couple of weeks away, and in October the 7th, um, much fancy game against their uh, home bay in the Robert Dice Cup. So, um, you know, let's get a few more people down there, let's make it a real memorable night for all the right reasons and, and uh, put on a feast of football for the Whitstable fans. We'd like to see more people here. Well, that's a great note to end it on. Thanks very much, gents. Thank you. Well done. Well done, boys. Thank you. Thank you, Gary.